I see it all around me, I can feel it, the sadness lurking in all their hearts, the empty voids that cannot be filled, the infinite unanswered questions. It doesn't help that we have all been plotted against one another, recklessly ripping each other apart, in a social structure that so easily makes us feel ugly, wrong, and unsure. Life should just be a natural flow of energy, how did we become so lost? What if I don't make it? What if I end up being too late? I cringe at the thought, my heart racing as I run towards the building, an image of her flashes in my head. There is a place in my mind, a dungeon where I go to try and tame the beast, a creature created by regrets and shortcomings. It's where all the darkest parts of me reveal themselves. I forged a weapon in this hell to protect you, because you are the air in my lungs. My destiny isn't written, and I swear to fight until I am only ashes in the forest. You must hearken these words, sharp sounds of truth designed by years of defeat. I chose to continue, they chose to carry on by my side. I will love them forever. I awake upon the beach where your footprints still resonate in the sand, the frigid water stained by bloodshot eyes. I recollect my thoughts, no martyr can save me in this day. I stand facing the sunrise questioning what is left for me. She haunts the room in a strange sense of numb. The dust has collected and the paint begins to peel. These walls still bleed memories of when this place was still vibrant and beautiful. Together we created a tomb, and alone I fill it with silences I can't ignore. I cannot deny that maybe I am a little addicted to this chamber. A cracked frame around a faded photograph. The rose petals no longer appear the same as before, and the thorns no longer hurt me.